We are just three days away from Super Bowl 50, and Kevin Frazier has been all over the action leading up to the big game. And today, he got the first question in at the big Coldplay press conference, and a lot of excitement, Kev. Yeah, Nancy, the excitement really building here in San Francisco. You know, Chris Martin and his band have a lot of big things planned for their show, including Beyonce. More than 100 million people are expected to tune in, but I was curious about two people in particular, Chris's kids with Gwyneth Paltrow. Are they excited about Dad's halftime performance? Apple and Moses, where will they be watching it from, and do they get how big this is? I hope they'll watch. I don't know what, what else is on that day. <laughs> will they be there with you? I hope so. It's hard to get tickets, man. <laughs> my son designed my shoes, so I asked him a few months ago, please could you make me some Super Bowl shoes? And he made two pairs, and one is for this, and the other is for the Super Bowl. So yeah, so yeah, they've been lovely about the whole thing. The band faced media from all over the world, and they know that the exposure they're going to get during the Pepsi Super Bowl 50 halftime show could be a game changer for their career. Everyone who does this show knows it's the biggest honor, it's the biggest privilege, and so they put their life and soul into it. And don't expect to hear them play their new song, Hymn for the Weekend, that Beyonce appears in. We're not actually playing that song because it only just came out. Right. So that would, would, I don't think it'd be quite right. Saturday on CBS, Kevin co-hosts the NFL Honors Preview Show with Melissa Stark. This is the Embarcadero on iconic Market Street here in San Francisco. Their show will be followed Saturday by NFL Honors on CBS, which is known as the Oscars of football. Patriot star Rob Gronkowski is up for a award at NFL Honors. Last year, he won Comeback Player of the Year. Now, I had a chance to hang out with Gronk at the Visa Everywhere Lounge. And let me just tell you this, lounging, not in this guy's vocabulary. What's the experience like for you being here, not playing in the Super Bowl? Uh, it's always a better experience playing, but at the same time, just coming, um, doing all the festivities, doing a couple appearances at some yeah. parties. It's just a blast. There's one guy you want to go out to the parties with. It's this man right here. Yeah. When I'm on fire, the party's turned up. <laughs> I really like oh, you mean like this Gronk? I really like it. Look out, Channing. Big man is gunning for you. Okay, Rob is also in San Francisco working with Visa to help spread the word about the multiple ways you can pay for all that Super Bowl 50 swag at places like the NFL shop. And they wanted us to tell you all about it. Visa makes it easy wherever I'm going. Just use the card real quick or just use it right off my phone to get whatever I need to get. I know you wear a helmet a lot of the time, so I figured I'd get you a, a shirt so everybody would know when you are rolling. Oh, man. All right, I appreciate that. Now, I want to show you what happened right after we turned off the cameras. There's a trampoline in the Visa Everywhere Lounge, and Gronk hopped on it. He's just a big 265-pound kid. 